my name is Jill and today I'm going to demonstrate to you guys how to make a homemade face mask as a cheap and alternative to an expensive store-bought face mask. We're only going to use four ingredients today and they can all typically be found in your kitchen, so that's a plus. The ingredients are oats, bananas, apple cider vinegar, and cinnamon powder which are all said to have natural moisturizing, purifying, and toning properties, which are all going to be really, really great for your skin. Um, according to the Journal of Pharmacognosy and Phytochemistry, the chemical makeup of the banana actually provides intense moisturization for your skin cells, which is going to be great if you're anything like me and you tend to have dry skin. It's going to really help, help to keep your skin hydrated and moisturized. The next ingredient is oats, and according to the Journal of Drugs and Dermatology, um, oats work to revive your skin using the anti-inflammatory properties that they have along with the moisturizing features that they consist of. The anti-inflammatory part of the oats is going to really help if you have any redness on your skin or if you experience any itching. It's going to really help to take that away, and just like the bananas, uh, the oats are going to help to keep your face moisturized and hydrated, which is really, really good. Um, from an article by uh, Kesha, the cinnamon purifies the skin and uh, using its, I'm sorry, using its antiseptic and antibacterial properties. So this is going to help to cleanse your skin, uh, remove any bacteria that you may have built up. It's going to help to really um, give you a clean finish. The uh, apple cider vinegar is our last ingredient, last but not least, and um, <clears throat> it works as a toner for your face. So it's going to help with your complexion and um, create an even skin tone for you. Uh, Carl Ori is the one who had mentioned that it has natural skin toning properties, and he is the author of the um, Healing Powers of Vinegar book. Okay, so now that you guys know that all of the ingredients and um, why they're good for your skin, we're going to put it together and put it on. So what you're going to need is a small bowl to mix all of the ingredients in and a fork to mash everything up. So as you see in here, I have a half of a banana that we're going to mush up. Uh, we're also going to use um, a fourth cup of the oats and... Uh, a fourth teaspoon of the cinnamon powder and a full tablespoon of the apple cider vinegar. So the banana is going to be the hardest to mush up. The rest is going to be pretty easy. I'm kind of using my fingers in here to assist me with this. All right. I'm going to add in the liquids. It might be a little bit easier to mix the banana up. There we go. Mush that up. So before you apply the mask, you're going to want to wash your face, wash it thoroughly, um, rinse it and dry it. You want to do that to have a nice clean palette for the face mask. Um, and then once your face is nice and washed, you are all set up to apply the face mask. The mask should make about enough for two uses, so you can put it in the fridge, store it for later and use it another time. So this banana is almost completely mashed up and we will be ready to put it on. There we go. So you just want to apply it uh, lavishly to your face. You don't need a thick coat of it. You just need a nice layer to cover the entire area of your face. So I'm going to use my fingers, get a little dirty here. And you're just going to apply it, there we go, everywhere. Really want to get my cheeks. So you can tell, just like, not like a store-bought mask that just go on really easily. It is going to be a little bit more difficult to apply it. Once you start putting it on, you're going to really feel the burn from the uh, apple cider vinegar.
All right, so you don't need the oath everywhere. As long as you can feel the makeup everywhere, you are set. My fingers are all dirty now, but just like that, I'm going to leave it on my skin for 10 to 15 minutes, and you'll be set. All right, guys, thank you for watching and getting dirty with me. Have a good night.